Hi everyone, today is Sunday, January 22nd, 2017, and we have had more signs that we're nearing the time of the great earthquake at the end times in the Bible of Revelation 12, when the dragon will rise. See here with the woman and the dragon, and there will be war in heaven with Michael and the dragon, and there will be a worldwide earthquake right here, and the earth helped the woman, and the earth opened her mouth and swallowed up the flood which the dragon cast out of his mouth. Well, we've had more signs down here near Solomon Islands. There was a 7.9 earthquake there today, January 21st, 8.30 p.m., late last night. And we have mapped out all of the world and have had this area mapped out for a long time because Solomon represents the man of wisdom in the Bible and Solomon's temple. And this actually maps out the end times coming. We show how the whole earth is as a matrix, and it shows God's ark ready to launch. Crazy or not, the whole earth is mapped out, and it shows these things. Right down by Bougainville Island was the earthquake, right about there. But you can actually see mapped out Jesus shutting the door right here. See Jesus right there shutting the door. And you can see how this is a heart because it represents the wedding feast of the Lamb right down to where this earthquake was. See that right there? And then you can actually see mapped out over here death rising. And that's what we're supposed to pass over. And that is the time when the red horseman of the apocalypse rides and he gets the great sword which is actually right here. See the great sword coming? We're supposed to go in that door and pass over when that great earthquake hits. Some people call it a rapture. I keep showing that is going to be a worldwide shattering earthquake. And then there's going to be some things even with Britain and such, and this large alligator rising up, and part of the beast out of the sea, and down here in the Bismarck Sea shows the wedding feast of the Lamb coming. See that there? That's where everybody goes to the wedding feast. And then up here is New Guinea, all of us basically going on to the next age, you know, but right here it shows the large arc ready to go. But all of that is coming. Right there is our door out, as we've been showing, for when this great earthquake happens. Now we've shown how these things are replayed over and over and over again. We've mapped this out for years. And right now at this time they will even show this gentleman here on the Google Doodle. See him right here? Mr. Ed Roberts, an activist. And such through here, he has passed away. He did many good things and such through there. But it's actually a sign of an end time individual coming. This guy in his chair is shown right here in the United Nations. This is the United Nations Council Room. We are supposed to go through this door at the end times when the great earthquake and this nuclear football is kicked. And then over here, do you see this individual in this chair with the woman riding the beast? Do you see this guy right there coming down? He's sitting in this chair. See him right there? Coming down. See, that's the same guy. Right there. Somebody's coming. We don't know exactly everything, but we can see these signs right in front of us. See how they put that right in front of us? And today on the 22nd or the 23rd, because this is the place where the great earthquake happened, we go in that door, and it's actually also shown in Washington. But we have been showing this for a long time. It doesn't mean something's going to happen right away. But Donald Trump and Obama all play roles in this as the end times begin. This is Washington, D.C. So this could just be another dress rehearsal for when the key is used to open the abyss. This is Washington, D.C. The White House is right there. And on the 15th, you can see this nuclear football teed up. And this represents the grievous head wound. And you can even see a goal post here with, and this is what's known as the Large CERN Hadron Collider. See all of that right there? See the goalpost? 
It might be during a football game. Might Maybe something might happen during the Super Bowl. We are not sure. Obama's role in, in this is to rise back up when all the cataclysms begin happening. Something might happen to Donald Trump. And that represents the nuclear football. The 15th. Tomorrow is the 23rd. Here it is showing this vampire guy coming down. See up here at the throne, the throne of Abraham, you can see this guy falling, which is called the fifth angel with the key to open the abyss. See him right there? So you can see that something, we're nearing a cataclysmic event. Now again, as we showed before, does this just mean that everything is practicing and going right along with the same end time scenario? We are not sure. Because even Obama plays a role in this. Obama has gone over to where exactly the abyss is opened. Right over here, Obama has gone into Palm Springs, right near the Salton Sea area, which is like a keyhole to open the abyss. And you can actually see mapped out, <coughs> see the green lines? It shows Obama and this mass coming off right by the keyhole for the giant earthquake in the San Andreas fault line and for him to rise as a phoenix it's shown right here on this glyph see the nuclear football see the phoenix and then see the beast down here with the sword for World War III all rising but it shows a we could be nearing a big event is it now is it being practiced it, we have to, you know, read the book of Jonah and you'll see that God continues with these signs and it's up to him to when he wants to start it. So there you go. And that earthquake was the same symbolism of the earthquake of Revelation 12. When the big event starts happening. And even when the dragon goes after the woman. And such all through there. So that's what all this means right with the earthquake happening right there when nearing the time of this door being shut for grace and mercy and the sword for World War III. We will have the first horseman, the second horseman gets this sword, the third horseman is as this beast right here which is the black horse and then you have the green horse of death. All of those getting ready to rise. And we even have this guy right here Mr. Ed Roberts, which represents that guy in the chair coming. There he is right there. See him? He's coming down. It's the same as this picture. This is the door shutting right here. Something might even happen to Donald Trump. The day of judgment will come. And way over here is the new Israel and the new Jerusalem with the tree of life and the Kabbalah. And the hermit represents the narrow way, and that's the wheel of the Great Tribulation, all coming. But that's that door shutting right there. That's this door ready to shut. When he shuts this door, the sword for World War III is given to the second horseman. Thank you very much, everybody. I'll see you at the wedding feast of the Lamb. And as we've shown in Revelation 12, that's when the great earthquake happens. And it's... Pray to the Lord. Maybe it's all just a sign, and a, as we've shown before, pract everything's practicing for the end times. Maybe it happens next month. Let's continue on. I'll see all of you at the wedding feast of the Lamb, which happens right there.